What's going on you guys, this is Aaron from Departures Capital and welcome to the video. In this video we're introducing an exciting new company to the channel and that company is called New Pacific Metals. Now New Pacific Metals is focused on discovering and developing world-class silver deposits in Bolivia and we know how important silver is in this day and age so I'm excited to be talking about the company and excited to be introducing it to you guys. Also for full disclosure details this is a sponsored video. Always check the description down below for full disclosure details along with thoroughly reading our disclaimer and always remembering that these videos are not financial advice. With that being said guys, I bring you New Pacific Metals. Now New Pacific Metals trades on the NYSE American under ticker symbol NEWP and on the TSX Venture under ticker symbol NUAG. Now taking a quick look at the stock chart, the company does have a 52 week range of $2.38 all the way up to highs of $6.36, currently trades right around $3. So despite the volatility in the markets, the stock has held on very well and it looks to have some nice support. Now, if we do get some relief within these markets, the price of silver picks up, you know, it might be a perfect time to take a look at new Pacific metals. Of course, once again, you know, these videos are not financial advice. So that's just strictly my opinion. So now let's go to their website to just get a little bit better of an understanding about the company. So New Pacific Metals is a Canadian company focused on the exploration and development of precious metal properties. Their flagship project is the newly discovered Silver Sand Project located in Bolivia. Silver Sand is Bolivia's largest silver discovery in the last 30 years. It is also one of the more significant silver discoveries globally in the last decade. So we did have the pleasure of interviewing Peter Maga, who is technical advisor to the company very famous in the silver industry. So we'll look out for that interview. It should be out shortly after this video. But now we're gonna go into you know some of their most recent news and then into um, the investor presentation to get a better idea of the company and everything that they're up to. So as of April 6th, they have put out some drill results. So New Pacific intersects 86.03 meter interval, creating 229 grams per ton silver at the Silver Sand Project. So feel free to take a look at those results. But I'm not going to go into detail. I am going to touch on the key points when it comes to their most recent investor presentation to get a better understanding of what the company does. So here we have New Pacific Metals, discovering and developing world-class silver and gold deposits in Bolivia, April 2022. So this is their most recent investor presentation. So to start, why invest in New Pacific Metals? So they've got their silver sand project, like I said, as their flagship asset a large pure silver deposit amendable to open pit and heat leach operations. The Karangas project, a broad silver and gold system discovered by 2021 drilling, and the Silver Strike project, a large exposed silver district, combination of silver sand and Karangas mineralization styles. So let's focus a little bit more on their silver sand project. So mineral resource estimate, estimated, measured and indicated, 155 million ounces at 137 grams per ton. Silver inferred resource of 35.55 million ounces at 112 grams per ton silver. So let's talk a little bit about Bolivia, a significant silver producing country. The Cerro Rico mine produced over 1.6 billion ounces of silver since the 1500s. Bolivia has the most stable currency in Latin America. Mining is responsible for 47% of its exports in 2020. Bolivia has been underexplored over the last 20 years and has realized the importance of foreign investment and technical expertise to grow its mining industry. New Pacific's silver sand discovery and rapid definition of a world-class silver resource has earned New Pacific a reputation in Bolivia as a reliable and trustworthy partner. New Pacific benefits from its first mover advantage and has acquired the Carangas and Silver Strike projects. So the Silver Sand Project. The Silver Sand Project at 4,000 meter elevation is located 35 kilometers from the Cerro Rico mine. 5.42 kilometers squared land package comprised of the Silver Sand Administrative Mining Contract and number two, the North Block, including Gisas, Jardin, and El Bronce concessions. So guys, in this video, you know, we're talking about the key points to the company and what they have to offer. So we're not gonna focus on every single fine detail, but I highly encourage you guys to head on over to the website, which is newpacificmetals.com. There's an investor tab, corporate presentation. You can find this corporate presentation there. And I highly encourage you to read it thoroughly and do your own research and due diligence. So, Silver Sand, a large near surface pure silver deposit. 
So here we have more technical information when it comes to silver sand. And then of course, the inaugural NI43-101 mineral resource estimate, which was released April 14th of 2020. So here we have it. There's the grading grams per ton in terms of million ounces. So measured and indicated 155 million, inferred 35 million. So some more information about silver sand. So a large near surface pure silver resource amenable to open pit mining like we talked about. Metallurgical heap leach column test yielded an average of 80% recovery, indicating heap leach process could be an option to recover silver heap leach operation relatively easy to conduct. Heap leach operation relatively easy to construct as it has low infrastructure and power requirements. The 2022 drill program is underway for MRE update and PEA study. So that's exciting. You know, right now drilling is underway, so we will have more information. And for an exploration company like this, drilling is really, you know, the most exciting part because they get the property ready. Once you start to drill, then you get to figure out what's in the ground. District potential for silver sand. Sampled from hundreds of surface dump sites and artisanal mining audits surrounding the silver sand deposit define silver mineralized belt 7.5 kilometers long and 2 kilometers wide. Artisanal mining dates back from the Spanish colonial area, multiple mineralized fracture zones steeply dipping west and extending over 800 meters along northwest 330, 340 direction. So here's some drill hole highlights. 32.96 meters at 517 grams per ton. Um, once again, I highly encourage you guys to take a closer look at all the drill results and the recent news for the company. Okay, guys, so that's a little bit more in-depth information when it comes to silver sand. Like I said, download this investor presentation. It is a very thorough investor presentation and it contains a lot of details, a lot of technical data, and we will also be in and we will also be releasing that interview with Peter Maga talking you know, a bit more about what's important, the opportunity, and the project itself. So, Karangas, a broad silver gold system discovered in 2021. So, six, so 6.25 square kilometer silver gold lead zinc project at 3,900 meters elevation, well-developed infrastructure and easy access via 10 kilometer road from a major highway, completed 13,000 meters of drilling in 35 drill holes in 2021, defining a mineralized system over 1,000 meters by 700 meters and up to 500 meters deep. Assay results for the first 25 drill holes have discovered an extensive near surface silver rich zone of mineralization stacked above a broad zone of gold mineralization. A 30,000 meter drill program is currently underway. So there's lots of drilling going on. 30,000 meters is quite substantial. And now we have Silver Strike, so a historic silver mining district to be drilled, 13 square kilometer land package located 140 kilometers southwest of La Paz, Bolivia at 4,100 meters to 4,400 meters elevation. 98% interest acquired for 1.35 million, New Pacific to cover 100% of future expenditures. Rio Tinto drilled eight diamond holes and 12 RC holes in 1995, drill ready targets. So Silver Strike drill ready targets at Silver Strike North. So the 2022 drilling at Silver Strike North will test South Top area. 27 dump samples from South Top plus North top plus valley zone, averaging 174 grams per ton silver and 1.22% lead. ESG commitment to sustain exploration and development, health and safety, environment, governance, and social. Common shares outstanding 155 million. So they've got two analysts, one from PI Financial and one from BMO. Silver Corp Metals owns 28.3% of the company. Presumptive retail, 40%. Institutional ownership, 14.3%. Pan American Silver, 9.5 in management, and the board own 8% of the company. Cash of 39 million, market cap of around just over 500 million at the time of this present at the time this presentation was put together, um, roughly 540 million. Proven leadership and experience. So Dr. Rufang, CEO and director, 25 years of experience as a founder of successful companies with significant discoveries of mineral resources. So take a look at the whole management team. This should be you know, a big part of your research and your diligence. And there we have it, guys. So that is the overview when it comes to New Pacific Metals. Three interesting projects, their flagship asset, Silver Sand, drilling results on the way. So it's gonna be an exciting time for the company. I'm excited to cover it and I'm very excited to drop that interview with Peter McGaw 
going a little bit more in depth when it comes to the company and their projects. So stay tuned for that. Thanks so much for watching, guys. It's an interesting time for silver as it's such an essential metal powering the future. So we'll see how things go. Anyways, we'll see you guys in our next video. If you like these videos, kindly hit that subscribe button and the bell for notifications. Drop us a comment down below. We'd love to hear from you. And finally, always remember Departure's capital is for information, education, and entertainment purposes only. Don't buy or sell a stock because you heard it on here. Buy or sell a stock because you've done your research, you've done your thorough due diligence, and you're making your own personal investment decisions for yourself. This video is not financial advice. Furthermore, this video may or may not have been sponsored by the companies that we've profiled within this video, and we may or may not own shares of any of the profiled companies in this video. If you want to know the full disclosure details, check the description down below along with thoroughly reading our disclaimer. Thanks so much for watching guys and I look forward to seeing you in our next video. Thank <laughs> you.